Hello YouTube, I am back with a quick reveal. This is of a Dunian birth bag that I recently, and when I say recently, I purchased it right after Christmas, between Christmas and New Year's. Uh, but I haven't had a chance to wear it. I did want to record this before I started wearing it, but it is a Dunian birth. It's not something that I would say I wanted. I did want something close to this style and on my way home I stopped at the outlet and I was just looking around and this one caught my eye I do have a handbag one handbag and bone already I usually don't make it a practice to purchase a lot of light colored bags but I felt because it was Dooney and Burke I probably would be okay so here it is. And this is the medium male satchel. And this is a medium sized bag. It is in bone, it has gold tone hardware and I really like this bag I had purchased one of the satchels I can't think of the name of it but it was a satchel is similar to this and it had the leather that went all the way down and around to the other side but I returned that one I actually had purchased that one in black and I really liked it but something about it um, I wasn't satisfied with it so I like I said I picked up this one I'm really happy that I did and I can't wait to start using it as soon as I get home I'm going to take that plastic off of the straps it comes with a longer crossbody strap the interior is red and I haven't even taken the paper out of it it has a inside zipper pocket and a slide pocket and I purchased this small keychain to go with it it didn't come with it but I'm really looking forward to wearing it so hopefully in the next day or so I will unpack it and switch over and we can look at it some more it has feet on the bottom which I'm very happy about and there's the back again and again this is a Dooney and Burt medium male satchel and thank you again see you soon Okay, I am back and I wanted to show you what actually fits inside of my bag. I already have it stuffed, but I'm going to pull everything out. These are my glasses. And the next thing is my cell phone. Well, my extra cell phone that I carry around with me. And my Dooney and Burt cosmetic case. And you can see down at the bottom, I have my Brahmin wallet, which I am loving. <laughs> that is such a pretty, pretty wallet. My earbuds. And I also have a Coach uh, round case. I just keep some floss inside of there. I also have my icebreaker mints that I keep with me. And all of this stuff fits inside of the bag and you still have plenty of space. And this is just a very roomy, really nice bag. I don't feel like it's really all that heavy either. You can put more items in it. You could probably put a water bottle in it, another phone if you have two. Um, you can carry stuff you know for your kids if you're out with your kids I like the color 
even though it's a light color and this is probably the lightest bag that I have I don't feel like it's gonna get really dirty it might get a little bit darker because it is a beige bone color but because it's Dooney and Burke I really don't I'm not scared of that because it's quality leather you can clean it up I do and now that I think about it, I do have an older Dooney and Burke bag in the same color. And it held up very well. And as you can see, the zipper, very smooth, nice quality. When you look at the leather, it is, is very nice. And I feel like it's just going to hold up for years like my other Dooney and Burke bags have. And like I said, for the size of the bag, I really don't think it's a very heavy bag. And I still have the keychain on front, on front of the bag. And you can see the, the dark tanned leather, which is just going to get softer and look better as time goes on. I also have the strap, but I didn't have it with me this day. But I want to thank everybody for watching again and please share, like, and subscribe.